This video is property of MBKP International LLC. In this video I'm going to show you adjustment on our electric paper cutters. This would apply for the EC19, like this one is, or the EC17, electric paper cutter. Basically, to do this adjustment, you need to pull this front cover off. Um, you don't need no tools if, you can, if you're strong enough. Usually just pull from one end and it pops it loose. And pull it out. If you, can, you can use a flat screwdriver if you had to, but basically it just slides in and pops in there. Once you get that off, I'm going to show you that what I'm going to be adjusting is this right here. It's basically a sensor. It rides up to get close to this wheel here, and this wheel turns when it's cutting. Now this adjustment is for if the paper cutter is, um, say you're trying to cut something, and you and the blade starts going down, it just stops. Or it's coming up and it just stops. It's, it's a possibility the sensor is out of adjustment. So we're going to adjust that. Let me show you how to do it. First you want to reset it, and you start with the cut. As you can see this, this um, wheel here. It starts here and it comes in here and it's a little bit narrower there. So this is the biggest part of it and it's going to be closest to this sensor. And that's how it knows when to start and start by this, the shape of this wheel. So basically you need to move it a little bit. So you just basically turn the... It, this is going to have to be down when you do it. So I'm going to turn it, bring the blade down a little bit and that wheel will turn. And I'll stop it. Okay, I stopped it right there with the big part of the wheel close to the sensor. This sensor is good because it's only a it needs to be about a sixteenth of an inch away from this edge of this wheel. If it's too far away, you need to loosen these two Allen wrenches here, Allen wrench bolts, and then when those loose, just slightly loose, you can push this whole thing in, towards this wheel more to where it's just barely away from it. About a six, the edge of this, the edge of this um, black box here, right there, just needs to be about a sixteenth of an inch away from the edge of this wheel here. If it's too far away from it, it won't sense this right, and it could stop on you in various places. So as long as this is about a sixteenth of an inch away, and make sure it's the big part of the wheel, because if you, if you adjust this towards this smaller part, and then you try to cut it, it's going to come, this big part's going to come and hit this thing and break it. So you're, we're talking about the biggest part of the wheel that, that, that comes furthest out. You want this thing about a sixteenth of an inch away from it. And once it's right there, you just tighten these back down. Okay, and that, that may take care of your problem if the blade's going down and, and stopping on its own without no reason.